Hey everybody, Dylan here from One Life Motivation, here again with you guys to talk about confidence. Why is confidence so important for you guys? Why you guys need to develop confidence? But mainly, I'm going to be telling you guys how you can develop confidence within yourself to be going about your days and to go into work or whatever it is you guys are doing with your day and to go in there confidently ready to accomplish your day and to make it the best day that you can possibly make it. Now, confidence is extremely important for you guys, and it's important to have this in life in general, because people who are extremely confident, naturally, they just accomplish a lot more in their life. Naturally, they are just more successful because they are extremely confident within themselves, and they know that they can do certain things, and they know what they can do, and they know what they can't do. So that's why it's extremely important to have confidence within yourself. So I got a list of seven steps you guys can take to become extremely confident today. So rule number one to become confident is know yourself. You have to know exactly who you are as an individual. Let me silence my sounds here. You have to know exactly who you are as an individual. If you don't know who you are as an individual, how are you going to be comfortable within yourself if you have no idea who you are as a person? You must know exactly what you like, what you don't like, what you enjoy doing with your days, ha uh, hobbies that you guys like to have. You need to know what you guys like to do, what makes you happy, what makes you positive. So that is rule number one. Then rule number two, what comes directly after you guys get to know who you are as an individual, what you like, what you want to do, uh, what you enjoy doing with your life, what you guys like to do with your hobbies, whatever it is, what comes directly after that is self-motivation. You guys are going to need to learn how to motivate yourself as an individual. You guys cannot count on outside sources to motivate you to do the things that you want to do. Let's say uh, you guys want to become a CEO of a company, just a random example. After you guys find out what you like to do and whatnot, what you enjoy doing, then you find the company that you would like to run, you guys need to learn how to motivate yourself to accomplish doing that. The longer you guys take to learn how to motivate yourself, the longer it will take for you to live a better life. You guys need to learn how to motivate yourself as an individual to accomplish things within your day. You guys are going to need to find the fire within you as a person, something that really drives you to accomplish things, something that really motivates you to accomplish amazing things in your life that you can accomplish. You are able to accomplish amazing things. You guys need to just need to find the fire, something that motivates you. Maybe it's a bad, you know, past experience. Maybe it's something you guys are striving to get. Maybe it's you're just striving to help people like me. I love helping people. I love helping them to develop or to improve themselves. You guys need to find something within you that really gets you motivated, that really gets you to a point where you're ready to accomplish amazing things, all right? So one, get to know yourself. Two, Get to know how you can motivate yourself as an individual. Then, after you guys know exactly how you can motivate yourself, number three is you guys are going to have to set goals. Set goals for you guys to accomplish. All right. Do not start big and broad. You know, don't start with like I want to be a millionaire in in a month. You know, be realistic. Set goals that you know that you can accomplish with you know within you know a few days or a week or a month. You know, stay within a month. I prefer, I like staying within a month. And then when you set those goals, set them to be realistic. Set the goals that you guys know that you can accomplish without, with at least 70% certainty. When you guys ask yourself uh, the goals you're going to be making, you need to ask yourself two questions. Am I 70% sure that I can accomplish this goal? And then number two, am I absolutely sure that I would enjoy doing this? Am I absolutely sure that I would be fulfilled by accomplishing this goal? You guys need to ask yourself these two questions every time you set a goal, all right? So know yourself, get motivated, and then set the goals for you guys to accomplish in your life. Then after you guys set your goals, you need to get out there and surround yourself with the correct people. You guys need to be making sure that you guys are surrounding yourself with people who are going to uplift you, who are going to make you feel better about yourselves, and not put you down and make you feel worse about yourself. This is extremely important for you guys in your confidence. If you're surrounding yourself with people who make fun of you or judge you or bring you down or, or judge you, you know, like, why are you doing this? You know, because there's always going to be people out there who are going to be, oh, why is he doing this? Or why is he, you know, setting goals? He's not going to be able to accomplish anything or, 
Oh, he wants to be the owner of a company? Forget about it. He's not going to be able to do that. There's always going to be people out there who are going to be trying to bring you down. The reason why they're trying to bring you down is simply because they are guilty within themselves for not doing what you are going to do. They're guilty within themselves for not going out and accomplishing what you are going to accomplish within your life. That is why they are trying to talk down to you and you need to remember that those people do not matter within your life. You need to surround yourself with people who actually care about you, who actually want you to do great things. If you surround yourself with awesome people like that, you are going to boost your productivity and you are going to reach success 10 times faster if you guys are surrounded by people who want you to accomplish great things. Now, rule number five, right after you guys surround yourself with the correct people, you need to talk with them. When you surround yourself with people who really care about you and people who really want you to do great and be great and be an awesome individual, you guys need to speak with them and tell them what's on your mind. If you're, if you're being bothered by anything or if anything is bothering you, talk with them. But however, realize that a relationship is two ways. Don't be the person who constantly tells people their problems and their situation or things that are just complain all the time. You guys need to talk with them, tell them how you feel, but also at the same time, be there for them. Be a great friend. Be a person who is there to help them and they will be there to help you. A relationship goes both ways. You know, make it a two-way street. When you're able to talk with people about how you feel, whether that's a, even if you guys want to go to a counselor or whether it's your friend or your family, when you talk with them, it makes you feel great because you guys aren't holding anything in anymore. The more you guys hold in how you're feeling or thoughts, the worse it's going to get. You guys cannot hold everything inside of you. You need to find somebody, someone or someone that you trust that you can tell how you're feeling or what's going on inside of your head. Because if you continue to have thoughts within your head and you don't you know, release how you're feeling, you guys are going to really end up down low. So you need to tell people how you're feeling, what's going on in your mind. And so I can guarantee you guys, if you talk with people a little bit more, you're going to feel better. I had this really bad uh, with myself as I hated to talk with people. I hate to talk to people and tell them how I'm feeling or if I'm upset about something, I always kept it in here. I never let it out. However, when I did let it out, I felt 10 times better when I let people know what I was feeling and what I thought because you're able to get it out and just get it out there. Or even if what works well is writing down on paper, just get it out of your system so you guys can just really just vent it out. Don't hold any anger, frustration, or anything in you. Find someone to talk to and find someone you can trust. Now, rule number six, I kind of touched on it a little bit earlier, is you cannot care what people's opinions are about you. The longer you care about what people think about you, the slower your process is going to be. You guys need to realize, like I said earlier, people are going to tell them or to talk about you behind your back. People are going to put you down behind your back. People are going to you know, brush you off like you're an idiot. They're going to do these things. The sooner you realize that people are going to do this no matter what you do, the sooner you realize that people are going to say whatever they want to say no matter what, the sooner you'll be able to move on with your life and move on to greatness. So, people, like I said earlier, people are going to say what they want because they're guilty within themselves. They see something in you that they don't have within them. So they want to talk about you so they can bring themselves up them, you know, within themselves. You know, they talk about you so they, they get that instant gratification of, man, that guy looks like an idiot, but I don't. I look good. And that's why they, people talk about other people is because they are guilty within themselves they're guilty of not wanting to do great things. They know they should. They know that they want to do awesome things, but they see you and they become jealous of you and they become you know, envious of what you are doing. You guys need to remember that they, that is the only reason why people will talk about you. Or same thing if you guys want to make videos or whatever. People are going to say that you look dumb or look stupid or people are going to say that you're an embarrassment, whatever. You just need to realize that these people's comments, they mean absolutely nothing. This is your life. You guys need to move on from it and realize that people's opinions mean absolutely nothing. Everybody who has become successful today has reached that point in their life where they just gave it up. They just stopped caring. Just, when I stopped caring about what other people thought about me, man, it was like the best thing I could have ever done for me. I used to care what people thought about me or uh, used to care what people you know, thought about how I looked or how I sounded, but now I just I could care less. It doesn't matter. You know, this is your life. You have one life to live. Why spend it caring all the time about what, what others feel about you? If you guys find what you love to do, 
find what you're good at, and then find motivation and strive for things that you guys want to accomplish, you're going to feel way better about yourself. You're going to be in your zone. You're going to be in your comfort zone. You guys are going to feel good about yourselves. And then when you guys, as soon as you guys stop caring what other people think about you, man, you are going to be able to accomplish so many things with your confidence. Now, last but not least, you guys, number seven, you guys need to be grateful for your life. You guys need to be grateful for what you have in your life. When you guys are making progress throughout this, you guys need to be grateful for the progress that you're making. Just be grateful to be alive. Be grateful to experience another day in your life. When you guys start accomplishing your goals, be grateful that you guys are able to accomplish your goals. Look at everything that you have now. The sooner you guys see what you guys have that others don't, you're going to realize that you really have it way better than others do. Just think about it. You might have, you can have fresh water, you have food, you have a house, you have a bed to sleep in, you're able to watch this on the internet, so you have internet, you could have a laptop, you could have a cell phone, you have clothes, you have shoes. Think about it. You have health, you're able to wake up today, you're able to have family members. Think about it for a second. You guys really need to ground yourself and humble yourself to realize what you have. The best feeling in the world is being able to feel grateful and thankful for what you people have. You have something that somebody else doesn't. And you need to realize that. The sooner you realize that you have things that others don't, you're going to feel great. You're going to be like, man, I have this. I'm able to have the opportunity to have this item or I'm able to have the opportunity to experience this or live here, whatever it is, so be it. You guys are able to have these things. It's an opportunity for you. Sit down for a minute today and think about what you guys have. Sit down for a minute right now and think about what you guys have that other people do not have. Alrighty, folks, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. This video, it really got me fired up and I'm, I'm really hoping it wasn't too long for some of you. I really got fired up during this video because you know it really touched me personally in my heart because I used to not be a very confident person. I used to be super insecure. I used to care so much about what other people thought about me, but it just fires me up because I know other people go through this and I want to help them. I want to help them out to accomplish, you know, be increasing their confidence and to help accomplish uh, I want to help them accomplish awesome things that I know that they are capable of doing. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe this video. Tell me what you guys would like me to talk about. Also, tell me some flaws about this video that you guys noticed, maybe something you don't like. And also, tell me what you guys enjoyed. Tell me which part of this video that you guys enjoyed. And uh, share this video with someone who could really use it. I know there's people out there who could really use a little confidence boots. And maybe they, they're not exactly sure how to boost their confidence. Maybe they're feeling a little lost. Share this with them right now and get this to them because they might need it and they'll thank you for it later. Also, comment below, like I said earlier, comment below what you are thankful for. Comment below what you have that someone else doesn't. Something that you are, have the opportunity to have that someone else doesn't have. Check out my books that I guys that I uh, released on Amazon. They're both 99 cents. My book Habits and my book Get Your Goals Right. They are awesome books being sold 99 cents. They're short little books, but they have massive amounts of information on there. Go and check it out right now. I put the links down below for that. Also, sign up for my new success course. My new success course that I released, it goes through the groundwork of how you can become successful. It goes over the groundwork that you guys will need to become an ultimate success. And then with that, I give you a free copy of my book, Habits. Free copy of my book, Habits, and a success course for you guys to become successful. It's plain and simple. It's an easy read. You're going to be going through these, and you're going to be getting massive amounts of information. And also, check out my website, One Life Motivation. I upload blog posts on there, so you guys are able to read. If you guys, maybe you guys are readers, or uh, that you prefer to read over listening or watching videos, I have a content on there that I put, and I transcribe this video. So please go and check out all those amounts of uh, uh, all the amounts of sources that I give to you guys. I put it out there for you. I really enjoyed sharing this video with my guys or with you guys. Uh, it really touched me dearly, and I really hope you guys get some uh, 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 confidence out there because it really helps me to create more content, seeing you guys make even more progress. So I really enjoy uh, seeing you guys make progress with all the stuff that you guys are doing. Please keep sharing with me what you guys are accomplishing throughout your weeks and your or your months. I love seeing what you guys accomplish your goals. All right, I'm closing out this video. I'll talk with you guys soon. Have a great week.